Cody Rhodes has a uh, big War Games match coming up next weekend. We're going to be talking Survivor Series here in a few minutes. I got predictions. I got a lot to say about this Survivor Series card. But before that, Cody Rhodes appeared on Busted Open Radio. And as part of his appearance, he discussed the possibility, or was asked about the possibility, or brought up the possibility of The Rock wrestling at WrestleMania 40. This is what he had to say about that topic. He says, you mentioned The Rock. Nobody has asked me about The Rock because I think they're scared to ask me or they don't want to be rude. I'll say this about The Rock, coming on Pat McAfee's show, which I was watching live because I love Pat. And then SmackDown and all of this. The Rock did for sports entertainment so, so much and continues to do so much by being the biggest star in Hollywood. That I'm able to be at the level that I am at is because I can stand on shoulders like those of The Rock. So he could have come on here and run me down and I still would have the highest respect for the great one. He is honestly a model superstar for anybody who wants to just supersede all expectations. With that said though, no matter what he said, anyone who did ask me, anybody who did confront me on it, I said I'm not flinching. I'm not flinching, and I feel like if The Rock and I were in the same room, he would expect nothing less from me. If you think that it's somebody else, I'm going to do everything I can to make sure you know that it's me. And that's the same attitude that The Rock had when he was climbing the ladder. I don't care who it is. If it happens to be The Rock, if that happens to be anybody who comes into this fray, a wonderful superstar like L.A. Knight, an absolutely stellar performer like Sami Zayn, who him and I went toe-to-toe in a way last year, line them up, and I'm just going to do everything I can to outrun them. And I mean that with the utmost respect to them. I wasn't shook at all by Rock's big day out. What I would say is this, not flinching. If Rock is a part of WrestleMania 40, that would be outstanding. He should be. It's The Rock. But I don't think he'll be in my spot. And Meltzer said that beyond Rock's comments on the McAfee show, he has heard nothing on the idea of Rock against Roman for WrestleMania next year. You know why? That's because it's not happening. It's not happening now that the Hollywood strike is over, and it wasn't happening before, when the Hollywood strike was still in full force. It was never happening. Brock came out and talked about how they came this close to making it happen this year at WrestleMania in Hollywood. I'm sure they had discussions. I'm sure they toasted with Terramana. And they thought, hey, we got an agreement here. This is going to be great. We're going to do Rock and Roman in Hollywood at WrestleMania 39. Still don't have a great explanation for why plans fell through and it didn't happen. And my whole thing this entire time has been that Rock is more in love with the idea, the idea of getting in the ring than he is actually training and getting back in the ring and wrestling a full match. Fact is, if Rock wanted to wrestle Roman Reigns in the main event of WrestleMania 40, and he committed to it right now, today, he picks up the phone, he calls Nick Khan, he calls Triple H, they get a Zoom call going, and he says, I'm all in on WrestleMania 40. If that happens, there's nothing Cody Rhodes would be able to do about it, (laughs) short of hiring his Nightmare Factory crew to kidnap The Rock and hide him somewhere until the Monday after WrestleMania, then they can release him. There's nothing that Cody would be able to do about it. Because if they have the ability to do Rock and Roman and they know that Rock is fully committed to it, maybe they get it on paper this time. Like, okay, now we're really actually going to do this. Again, there's nothing Cody Rhodes would be able to do or say that's going to change the main event from Rock against Roman. But I have respect for Cody for what he said there. He's standing up for himself. You know, he's saying, look, I have the utmost respect for The Rock. I think the guy is great. I wouldn't be in the position I'm in were it not for people like him, right? I'm on the shoulders of giants and legends in this industry. But I'm not worried about him taking my spot because it's my spot. I've got my story. I'm going to finish my story. And that's the end of that. That's exactly the attitude that he should have. Because he's the one who's been around, not The Rock. He's the one who somehow, even though, again, they I think they screwed the pooch on that finish at WrestleMania 39. And that could have been with anybody, by the way. Didn't have to be Cody. But you look at what they've done with Roman Reigns this year. I mean, it was ridiculous. But... He has stayed over. If anything, he's even more over now. The fans like Cody. They genuinely like him. They have a genuine star in Cody Rhodes. And they're all in on his story. I was worried about the same thing. You know, the way the fans turned against him in AEW, that they would do the same thing to him in WWE. 
Yeah, he does come out sometimes and has that air of of pretentiousness about him. I could see where that would be a turnoff for some people. Or when he cuts his promos and uses these big words, you know, he doesn't come across as being a man of the people the way that his father used to. And I thought that maybe that would be a problem and the people would turn against him, right? Or the smart fans would turn against him. I think part of what happened, though, the problem in AEW is, if you remember, it got really ridiculous with Cody. He was coming out with these giant entourages that kept getting bigger and bigger and... You know, again, it just it, it turned people against him. And he's been able to avoid that in WWE. And I think people would be just fine seeing him come back one year later and tell that story about, okay, I fell on my face last year, and now I'm coming to Philadelphia. I'm coming into WrestleMania 40. We're going to do this again. And this time, he's going to come out with the championship. 